If you are still wondering what to do with your leftover turkey last Thanksgiving, here are two easy recipes for you. You can also make this recipe using leftover chicken. For this recipe, you will need chopped turkey or chicken, chopped deep fried pork belly, deep fried tofu chopped in small cubes, chopped red or white onions, green bell pepper, Red bell pepper, red chili if you want it spicy, mayonnaise, nor seasoning sauce, and oyster sauce. In a bowl, we are going to mix all the ingredients together. The reason we are adding pork belly in this recipe is because the turkey meat is very dry. We will need that pork fat from the pork belly for flavor. You can also refrigerate this mixture to use the next day. The following day will be the best to use this because the tofu and the turkey soaked in all the flavor. Heat your pan and add a little oil. Once your pan is very hot, you can add your seasoning mixture. You can also add soy sauce according to your taste. At this point, you can add your chili peppers or you can add it after cooking.
simple yet delicious turkey sisig. Yum! Our next recipe will be turkey lichon paksiw. As I've said, you can also use leftover chicken. You will need turkey or chicken chunks. Mang Tomas lichon sauce, bay leaves and peppercorns, salt to taste and vinegar, brown sugar, and water. In a pot, we will mix all our ingredients except for the turkey and brown sugar. Mix and let it boil for 5 to 10 minutes. When it's boiling, we can add the turkey. Let the turkey soak all that deliciousness. Add in our sugar and mix. Let it simmer but don't boil it for too long for the turkey tends to be dry. And there you go, your yummy lichon paksiw turkey or chicken. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please like, subscribe, and share this recipe to your friends and family. Thank you for watching. This is Melody Table Treats. Love in every bite. Until next time!